there's a portion of the property, literally a stone's throw from the edge of our house that burned and burned quite high into the sky. Those flames reached quite high. They were over 100 feet. David Bussey will never forget that day 20 years ago when the cedar fire came just inches away from his home. And then all of a sudden the wind shifted and everything was saved. But there are others who weren't as lucky as David, who came back to nothing but debris where their homes once stood. After that experience, members of the community came together to form the Poway Neighborhood Emergency Corps. The purpose was to help residents prepare for emergencies like wildfires by showing them how to create defensible space as well as having an emergency plan in place. The philosophy revolved around neighbors helping neighbors. And we tried through the Poway Auxiliary Communications Team. Terry Sorensen is the president of the Poway Neighborhood Emergency Corps. We are always looking for ways now to um, better uh, reach our residents of Poway in the different needs that they have. From helping neighbors put together evacuation plans for their animals to helping residents get affordable homeowners insurance in fire prone areas. In May, California's largest home insurer, State Farm, stopped selling insurance across the state, something other providers started to do as well. And it's a challenge David has been facing for years. This is the fourth time that we've been dropped by various carriers. And uh, this place has, by my knowledge, hasn't burned in 50 years. So to get around this, the Poway Neighborhood Emergency Corps is working to get neighbors on board with the FireWise USA program, which offers discounts on insurance. All they have to do is apply to become a FireWise community. Neighborhoods form a board that collaborates with local wildfire experts and they perform wildfire risk assessments. If they can get enough people, Poway will be the second city in the county to have this program, something David says is a win-win for everyone. There was also a willingness to be a part of a solution that morphs and changes and goes forward. Marie Cornell, ABC 10 News.